everyone, welcome back to the walkthrough. Yeah, looks like we finally ran out of mail. <laughs> That's okay with me, though. <laughs> the Starshine Beach Galaxy begins, and there's a couple of tricky stars here, but nothing dangerous per se, if I recall correctly. Green Star 1. Here we go! I see you one up the tree! But it's, uh, I don't think that's number one, though. Might be number one. That that silver star, again, yeah, not not officially a green star. <laughs> yes. Alright, let's go relax with the Piantas at the Isle of Delfino! <laughs> star, it's on the way down! Yeah! Okay, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm, good. I'm, I'm, I'm not good. I'm good. I want those star bits! Uh, okay, well, no, no, I gotta calm down. Gotta calm down. There's just a lot of star bits at once. I haven't collected that many star bits at once in a while. It just got me a little bit excited. Okay, so. I'll take care of you for one thing, I guess. Well, actually, no, I don't really have to. I could probably just, you know, just do that if I wanted to, but yeah, I don't really think there's anything up there per se, but I'm just gonna go ahead and see if I can use that balloon there, well, balloon berry to, uh, that was perfect aim, to get up on top of that tree. Like, oh, I could use this one here. Never mind. Never mind. Because, <laughs> yeah, I think that, that up there is number one. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hold my breath here. I'm not sure how useful this will be. Might be better than the other one because it might be close enough. Well, eh, well, that might not be the intended method. I bet it's something like this. You do get on this block, get up here at the Yoshi, and yeah, jump off of Yoshi. I don't know which star that was though, but <laughs> that was a star. Let's just put it that way. Let's see the counts. Is it one? Is it two? Is it three? Probably one, actually, because I think number two is under that uh, structure at the far right corner. Yeah, that, that was one. Alright, we're organized so far. <laughs> Next up, number two, of course. Doo -doo -doo -doo. The other one, uh, the third one, I don't quite remember exactly where it was, so that could be an interesting scavenger hunt, considering the size of this level and all like that. But let's just focus on the one that I do know where it is, which is Green Star number two. You can see it, well, maybe you can, or can't, I don't know, underneath that uh, water tower-like structure, as I said, at the upper right corner, right, like right around here. I think you can actually see it floating over there. I uh, see that little, little tiny dot there that I'm pointing out at the edge of my star under it? Yeah, over there. <laughs> I think. I think. I could be wrong though. Well, I, anyway, I need <laughs> I need the power of the Bulberry Starvitz Starvitz help too. Okay, maybe they don't help that much, but they help for the future grinding, I guess. But yeah, I think I need the power of the Bulberry again to reach it, or I use the power of the Dash Pepper. I don't remember which one of the two I used to get it, but we'll see. I'll just use for one thing the Dash Pepper to try a Dash Pepper method to get it. But yeah, see it up there? I don't think that is possible to get with this. Yeah, I think it's just a little bit too high up. It's all the way up over there. That just ain't happening. <laughs> but, um... Well... Oh boy. <laughs> I just gotta look for a close by Bulberry. Uh, well, I hear one nearby. That might be... Oh, that's still the one that I got in the tree, okay. That, that explains a lot. <laughs> they have the same twinkle regardless of completion level. <laughs> uh, well, there's a... Hmm... Hmm... Yeah, was, mm, no, I don't really see... Like, uh, maybe jump off of Yoshi? I don't recall needing to jump off of Yoshi to get that, though. I suppose it's possible that was the solution, but I don't think this was... Like, oh no, I can't, that's right, I can't do it in the water anyway. <laughs> that, that won't work then. Um, um, I guess I could try holding a bulberry in for a long time, but I don't think that will really be working, because yeah, look at my air 
Well, this might work. This might... Mm, e Whoa! That would work. <laughs> can I get on Yoshi? Can I get... Yeah, I can get on Yoshi. Okay, I gotta try that again. I think that might have been how I must have did it before, because that's really far out of the way. And I believe when you're selecting this particular star, um, that gate down there is closed, so you can't... You can't exactly go up to the tippy top, so yeah. Okay, so <laughs> I'm gonna try this again, get as much possible distance away that I can be from the berry. There we go. <laughs> Alright, we're off. I hope I didn't lose too much air at that point, but we'll see. Maybe I should actually let myself go a little higher than I can sort of multi-flutter jump over there. Oop! I failed to jump off of his back, and you see me do the little crouchy crouch too. It was just too late, just too late. But yeah, as I said, these, the stars here aren't very dangerous. It's just just a matter of execution. <laughs> and yeah, I think this was indeed the one that uses the bulb. Uh, I, I could use the camera tune, please. Uh, yes, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I think it is definitely possible to do with the. Uh, off Yoshi and spin off! <laughs> come on! Come on! <laughs> I wonder where that third one is, though. I'm a little puzzled by that. It might, maybe it's probably in like the underwater area or something like that. Because that's the only thing that's really not visible. Uh, you know, from the outside area. Unless it's off the edge or something like that and you jump for it. <laughs> that's always a possibility. Oops, no, 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 not. It's too close. Get it. Perfect amount. Perfect. Perfect. There we go! <laughs> By the way, I am holding the button as soon as I can. Well, except for that one time that I mentioned that I didn't. The thing is that Yoshi always automatically exhales a little bit of air right away. Oh, shoot! <sighs> I let go of the button too... too late. <laughs> that was bad timing on my part. Come on, come on, come on. It's just... You know, and a little bit of execution goes a long way here. <laughs> yeah, there we go. But yeah, I think that is the closest bulb berry to that one, unfortunately. <laughs> I would just jump down to it from the top, but I don't really think that's feasible. Yeah. Okay, that works. Yeah, that was plenty. <laughs> I absolutely maxed out everything on that one. Okay. Was that two, or was that three? Because if it was three, I mean, if it was... Yeah, if it was three, then two's gotta be off an edge somewhere. Uh, no, it was two. So I'm guessing that when we select star three, then... the undersea passageway will open, and that'll lead to... another star, probably. <laughs> All I know is... I've gotta go back in and get that other star, wherever it is. And yeah, I don't remember... whatsoever. <laughs> I'm sure I'll hear a twinkle somewhere as I'm exploring stuff, so... We will see... Uh, yeah, this is so... No, this is still the first one, because it's... Yeah, it's still... Hmm... So that means the undersea passageway isn't unlocked? Is it? Like, can I see it off the edge somewhere? Off of something, maybe? From a distance? Probably not. I have activated the ghosts. <laughs> I don't, I don't really think that's gonna be... Uh, oh, shoot, I'm gonna lose the ghost. <laughs> I don't think that uh, Luigi's gonna be leading me to any sort of green stars anytime soon or anything like that, but I suppose we could follow him around while we look for some sort of sparkle or hear some sort of twinkle. <laughs> Luigi's probably just gonna lead to some sort of bonus type area. Uh, where'd he go? <laughs> Oh shoot, I'm- uh oh I'm falling. Well... <laughs> yeah, anyway. Oh, he went all the way around. Oh, oh, okay. Um... Did he wait for me? <laughs> Hello? Did, wh what did you show me over there? <laughs> um... I don't understand. that this this arrow's going in both directions. What? <laughs> I, I think I missed something there. Maybe, maybe. Uh, yeah, you went off here. You hit that. <laughs> Obviously, because that's where the arrows led. So then you jumped off here. 
And then what, what, what do you go this way? Would he do something to these? <laughs> I don't know. But then he went off that way and then he, he took a nap. Oh, is that... Is that a green star up there? It is. Okay, I, I didn't see that one up there before. Was it because I selected... Oh, was it because I selected a different star this time? Maybe? Oh, yeah, yeah, this, this has to be a different one then because... Lakitu's aren't here, so then... So then, there's a whole other sort of kind of puzzle going on to get that one. <laughs> so, okay, so we are absolutely in a different world of sorts. Hey, Chucksters. How's it going? That's not useful at all. No, that's not. <laughs> so, okay, I'm presuming that I've got to go down and get a Yoshi or something. I mean, I've got to go get a Yoshi somewhere, someplace. Let's just go down through here see here, because uh, maybe it's the power of the water cannons that we activate. Maybe, it might be, probably, could be, we'll see. <laughs> so, yeah, that, that's why I suspect it's the water cannons, because you know the water cannons around the whole place activate. When you go through this, then you hit the switch, and yeah, and then you, there's actually a whole other host of cannons and stuff like that around here that I didn't really go through, did I? <laughs> uh, oh, that's, what? Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, I thought that activated this. It does, it does. <laughs> okay, so... I guess it's not a Yoshi we need, it's the power of the flower that we need. Okay, so... What we can do here is just conserve our power of the flower, and you know, because you can't step in the water while you're in cloud form, otherwise you'll lose your said cloud form, so this this will work just fine. Okay, so yeah, obviously it's straight up above here. Don't touch the water. Don't! 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 Okay. <laughs> uh, how much height can I get off of this? Uh, is that enough? I don't think that's... Uh, oh, it's enough. <laughs> Alright, so that's all I didn't see where the third one was. It's just because it was a totally different selection. <laughs> Alright, there we go. 100% complete Starshine Beach! Heck yeah! Woo! And now we can go over to the other galaxy and finish off World 4. Uh, I don't know if I'll do more than that this part. It all depends how smoothly it went, because that one went kind of long. <laughs> and I guess if I cut some stuff, but I don't know, it doesn't really give you a feel as to the kind of attempts that I would have to do then, would it? I don't know. I try to avoid cuts just to kind of emphasize any sort of problems that occur, if possible. <laughs> I heard some sort of something at the beginning. I think it was one of the gear modes, though. Anyway, I believe the first green star is, yeah, behind those chomps over there. So it's pretty near the beginning. It's just a matter of getting yourself over there. And... That, if that involves some fancy chomp popping. Because remember how I showed you this? Oops, showed you this before. Which is you do backflips around the chomps, and then they're like, "Oh man, we can't hit ya!" Yeah, just accidentally collected the comet medal there. And then I'm gonna go here. I can't see. Okay, <laughs> I got lucky there. I guess the chomp got in my way. <laughs> I'll take it. I just did a long jump and hope for the best with my spin timing. Because, you know, I, I sort of have a feel as to how the descent will be on my long jumps and stuff like that, just from playing it a bunch of times. Not not this particular star, but I mean, just playing the game, you know, you, you just do, the, you do a lot, lot of long jumps, you get a feel for said uh, long jumps, you know, just how you're going to fall, how what the height is, stuff like that. Even the speed you'll get the hang of, just as long as you keep playing it. And green star number two. And you know, if you really want to get the hang of a game, you could try and just mess around just like on a nice open area, just try and do all sorts of trick moves to get on top of places, just to see what you can do with your move set and stuff like that. It's a good time. <laughs> the joys of gaming, like the joy of painting with Bob Ross. <laughs> oh, anyway, anyway. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and, well, 
I thought I could actually cheese that a little bit, but maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, uh, nope, doesn't look like I can. <laughs> fine, fine, I'll do it the way that I showed how to do it before. Fine, fine. Maybe I'll do... I was gonna say, maybe I'll just do it a double jump to get up there, but nah, nah, it's fine. <laughs> Here we go around, get on this platform, stay on this edge, let you have enough time to react. And there you go. Prepare yourself for a star! Woo, thank you. <laughs> it's a nice work, that's why I said thank you. Alright. I'm thinking that the green star is up above, um, if I recall correctly. Can I go in the first person? But I think it's above that place over there, I think. This is still funny, by the way. <laughs> but I'll have to see once I wander around here. Whoopsie doodle! Uh-oh. Oh, I thought I was gonna slip in the lava. Oh, I'm good. <laughs> so, whoop! Yeah! Oh! Can I check my first person's? No? Okay. So now I think... I'm just gonna wait over here. Uh, there's a one up up there, but I don't... Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, no little chomps coming out of here on this particular star? Interesting, but I'm hearing a twinkle. Can you hear that? Yeah, I think it is indeed around here somewhere. Just not where I thought it was. Um... Camera, please? That's more towards this way, I guess. Um, I'm gonna just do this and aim for the platform that I was already on. <laughs> okay. Uh, anywhere that I can get a first-person view would be, whoops, would be lovely, but that, it, it, it's, it's not going to happen, I guess. <laughs> I guess I'll have to take a look-see as I redo this, like as I fly through there on the star. I mean, using the star and fly through the air to get to that platform. Maybe that'll be useful, maybe... we'll see. <laughs> right, obviously, this is not the sparkle that, you're, that you want to be going for here. Don't, well, the one that you're hearing now, that one, whoops, that one is a sparkle already taken care of. Go ahead and squish those Octumas for me, thank you! <laughs> I don't think I showed that before, that you can actually squish them with the... Ah, uh, the camera didn't really give me a good view of that. Uh, is there anything, any, any place... I should really hit this this time. I didn't think it would be that that dangerous to look around for stuff. Um, is there anything that I can... Mm, I cannot go into first person view anywhere here. That's kind of ogus. <laughs> mm, mm, well, I know I'm getting warmer if I go to here. <laughs> Ish. Actually, I'm not hearing a twinkle now. Um... I just don't want to do that. Or maybe the twinkle that I heard was this star. I don't think so, though. And whoop, whoop, whoop. Because, I, when I, because when I was up here... Yeah, I could hear it when I was up here. Unless it's somewhere that I can hear on the next planet over. Maybe. I'll just try this. I'll just... Oh, it's up there. <laughs> okay, so we are indeed on the right track now this time. Um... Well, is there a higher place that I can use to get up on top? Mm, probably, probably. Like here. This will do. I don't want to activate the chomps because it'll just cause me a little bit of trouble there. Alright, and I think we've got it. Oh, there's a chomp over here! Oh, I forgot all about that! <laughs> I should have showed down my first run, but I forgot. Alas. Alas. Anyway, green star collected. Yeah! And as you can tell from the other flight, uh, you know, to that last planet over there, that rounded lava one there, it, it looks like a chomp from a distance, but it's kind of hard to tell when you're close up. Alright! Green star 2. <laughs> Number 3, as you'll probably guess, and well, at least I'm guessing, is that it's going to take me down the other path of starness that, you know, it wasn't the same pathway through Chompworks Galaxy. It took through a, a different way, because I I don't think the last star was on the lava chomp-shaped planet. Could be wrong, though. We'll see. <laughs> As I said, my memory on the green stars kind of sucks. Yeah, this is a different star variety going on here. 
And yeah, maybe this is the one that I thought I'm supposed to get up there uh, on that chomp walkway with the, with the springs. Maybe, maybe. I'll activate Luigi, why not? <laughs> Look at Luigi. He's, he's not a spring, but he's acting like he's a spring. <laughs> Woohoo, indeed! Now I can speedrun this faster than Luigi can. Oh, he's actually going over there, really? Woo! So then that's probably a, uh... What is that, the spot to get? Uh... He's just springing his way over there. <laughs> uh, what is he going for? Is there a one-up up there? There might be a one-up up there. <laughs> Maybe I'll check that later, I don't know. It seems like it's a little bit out of the way at the moment. Oh yeah, feel the power! Feel the power of Chomp repelling! <laughs> yeah, not hearing any tinkle thus far. Oh, I'm gonna land on that, yup. I was gonna say, I didn't have that quite timed right. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. We're still alive. We could still get another spring -a ding Destroy that for me, please. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, you got you gotta get me close enough to the chomp to actually get over it. So yeah, you don't wanna be too close to it either, because then you're gonna have higher landing on it. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, off the wall. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm still not hearing any sort of twinkle yet, so. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> Oh shoot! No, 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 no! Oh shoot! <laughs> Spring controls are weird. Well, I got that checkpoint though, so... Eh. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, I don't see anything or hear anything around here, so it's definitely gotta be at a different location than the, these first areas that I've been exploring. So yeah, it might, might be the case with Green Star like I thought. <laughs> Do, 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 and upsy doodle. Okay, this time I'm just gonna go straight. Just, just go. I don't even think I need the spring a ding to get up there. I could do some fancy jumps to get over there. <laughs> Jump shape here! Okay, there's the green star. Now, I remember ish. <laughs> now, I think you still need this to actually get up there. So it's gonna be difficult to actually get that green star. I might be wrong about needing this though. Like, I might just be able to do some fancy wall kicks and spins to get up there, but eh, we'll try this method first because, well, I'm already kind of in the middle of it. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. It's so fiddly. Ah! I need to get high enough to get to that tippy tower type place. By the way, you are in the side-scrolling mode, by the way, so you don't have to worry about flying off forward or anything like that. Okay, so... Anything would be willing to uh, hit me to knock my uh, spring power out of here? That would be lovely. Uh, that's pretty far out. I think I might just have to go for a leap of faith! Uh, well, well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that spring sure has a lot of grip to it. And so yeah, I don't think I would have actually been able to do that with regular Mario. Except maybe with a really lucky blind jump off to the side, you know, with a long jump, if I managed to get up there as regular old Mario, so... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, now... I, now I'm kind of curious about Luigi's trek through the chomp, so before I end off the part, I think I'm gonna go back over to Green Star 3, or, well, I guess you could do it on Star 3 as well, probably, because that's that's the one that I played as Luigi to uh, unlock the ghost to begin with. So I'm just gonna select that, because I can mash through it nice and quick. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if the speed will be any different. Yeah, I don't know, watch... His move. I don't know if he's just going for that one up or not. I mean, he, he just might be, which would be kind of kind of pointless. <laughs> kind of, if you think about it. Uh, woo! Uh, we're going to go, geez. Oh, geez. <laughs> Maybe I should just just watch Luigi and see what he does, like from a from a nice safe distance. <laughs> I don't know if he's actually going up on top of that uh, 
I can't even go in the first person there. I don't know if he's going on top of the structure or anything, like over there where the chomps are, or if he's just going to get said one up. But at the very least, I know I can go in the first person view up over here, so I'm just gonna take a hit from this chomp over here. Or I guess I could have hit, you know, what in there, but that, that, that it works just as well. <laughs> You know, if I would hit the launch star, or touch the launch star, I should say, it would have been a, uh, uh, a decent way to get that. Oh, okay, it, it is indeed just to get that one up. See how he's laying down over there now? Okay, so... It is something that... Actually, you know what? You don't even need the power of the spring to get that. <laughs> this is way easier than the spring. Like, 180 times easier than the spring. Okay, can I get up on this thing? I never tried that before. You can, actually! Wow! Look at that! I'm just finding out stuff left and right here. <laughs> can I get the same plan from there, though? Ooh, yeah! Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm done messing around here. <laughs> Back to the map. I go. <laughs> that was fun to mess around, though. Well... I'm gonna end out the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I begin World 5, because, as you might have guessed, World 4's been crowned. So, yup, yup, and yup.